Hello guys, I'm engineer Muhammad Adnan Khan and you are watching my YouTube channel Being Engineer. In this video lecture, we will discuss the requirements of good stairs. But before we start our today's lecture, you are requested to please watch my previous video in which I had discussed the technical terms used in the staircase so that you can get the understanding of this topic that is requirements of good stairs. The link of that video is given in the description. Before watching this video, please watch that video. In this video, we will discuss 15 important points which should be kept in mind while designing a good stair. So let's get started. Location. Stairs location should be in the middle of the building or at a place where it is accessible from different rooms. The second point is shape and size. Each step of the stair should be in uniform shape and size. The third point is pitch or slope. Now what is pitch or slope that I have discussed in the previous video, the link of which is given in the description. The pitch or slope of the stair should be between 25 to 40 degree. Number four, width of the stair should be three feet or 85 centimeter minimum. The height of the headroom. Now what is headroom that I have discussed in the previous video? Height of the headroom in any case should not be less than 2.5 meters. Number 6. Height of the handrail should be between 75 to 85 centimeters. The maximum number of steps in a single flight should not be more than 15. And the minimum number of steps in a single flight should not be less than 3. Number 9. Material. The material used in staircase should be durable and stiff. It should also possess fire resisting properties. Point number 10. The surface of stairs should be rough and coarse. Number 11. Staircase should be well ventilated. Number 12. Width of each step should be of adequate size so that anyone can step and climb easily. 13. The width of the landing should not be the width of the landing should not be less than the width of the stair. Number 14. Winders. Winders should be avoided as much as possible if needed may be provided at the lower end of the flight. Number 15. The height of the riser should not be more than 20 cm. Before we end our lecture, I will I am going to give you a bonus point that is point number 16 that is the width of the tread should be more than 11 inches or 28 cm. That's all for today. In the end you are again requested if you are not subscribed to my channel please subscribe it and press the bell icon.